Welcome, Waffle Wolfettes. We are back with the brilliant Far Cry 6 on the PlayStation 5. And I hope you guys and girls are having an absolutely fantastic day. Now, in the previous video, we took over an oil rig and we stole a bunch of circuit boards. We then took those circuit boards to Philly and he used those circuit boards to repair his machine named Daisy and he then produced us a ton of napalm. We then blew up Daisy so that she didn't fall into the hands of the enemies and now what we're going to be doing today is we are going to be stealing both a plane and also a pitching machine for Philly. So let's get straight into things. Now I did a few things off camera. I did a couple of those ambush missions where you get yourself a bunch of supplies and I also did one of those supply drop missions where you also get yourself a bunch of supplies. So we've now got enough supplies where I can upgrade my weapon and also my Supremo. But I also did another thing off camera and I completely ballsed it up. Pretty much I was trying to build the building inside our camp that will give us more recruits for Benito and also where you can buy many many good sets of armour but I accidentally bought the Gorilla Garrison which is the building that gives you better gorillas on the field so when you meet gorillas out on the battlefield they've got like better weaponry and stuff like that and also allows you to buy several new weapons which is a good building but I didn't want to get it yet so I bought the wrong building Wolf and Wolfettes I completely ballsed it up but once we get to the next area we will build the right building. It's kind of a shame that you can't just build all six of the buildings on Libertad. That would make a lot more sense, but nope, you can only build two buildings per camp in each of the three areas, which just sucks to me. Right, let's go and get this pitching machine then. Oh, I also took down an anti-aircraft gun as well, which is going to be important for this video, because when we steal the plane, we don't want to be shot out of the sky by a bunch of um, anti-aircraft guns. <laughs> now, I think this... Um, I think this baseball field, I don't know, I don't remember if there was enemies there or not. I don't know if it's just going to be an empty baseball field and we steal a pitching machine or if there's going to be a bunch of bad guys there playing baseball. I can't remember. So we're going to have to go in there very cautiously. I'll probably just airdrop in and land on the roof. That seems to be the best strategy for Batman. If you didn't know, my main character isn't Danny, he's actually Batman. <laughs> That's why we always swoop in with our wingsuit like Batman. I love the sound of helicopters and planes when they fall from the sky. That noise they make when they're falling. Beautiful, ain't it? Very satisfying noise. Are they playing baseball? You are dead. Man. Are they playing like some sort of... Are they playing some sort of like psychotic baseball game? Is that a baddie? Sorry about that. My thumb felt very weird then and I was aiming really badly. <laughs> My thumb sort of like locked up a little bit and I couldn't move the analog stick properly. There's a couple of hostages down there. If I rescue them, is it going to count as recruits? Because I need one more recruit to do my next mission. I don't know if they know where I am. That guy over there that I shot at like four times didn't see me, I don't think. There is a really good set of armour you can get where you basically just never get seen. It's only like one piece of armour as well. It's very good. I'm just going to kill everybody from up here. And then I think the pitching machine is in one of those rooms. But I think we need to kill somebody with a key. Oh, that was fucking beautiful, wasn't it, Wolf and That was beautiful. Even though we've now been spotted by the sniper, but that was beautiful, wasn't it? Oh, look. How does he not know what's going on? Oh, there we go. That's the leader. That's got to be the one with the key. Oh, no, the key's over here. All right. Well, we didn't get spotted. Well, we did get spotted by that sniper, but I think we killed him before he was able to tell anybody. I don't think you want to get spotted in this bit because I think they might call a helicopter for backup. And you don't want to deal with a helicopter. I mean, we've got a Supremo to blow it out of the sky. And we've also got our upgraded pyrotechnic uh, weapon as well. So, oh God. So we won't have to worry anyway. Oh, sweet, they count as recruits. Very nice. Okay, we're going to have to make sure 
we take, uh, we go back and set Benito out on a mission. To unlock new uh, leaders in this game for that uh, mission board, you need to do the Yaren story missions, which counts as missions like uh, these ones right here. If you do these Yaren story missions, some of them lead to new leaders for you to recruit, and then you can send them out on missions. And if you build that building that I was supposed to have built, then it's a lot easier for you to get a ton of recruits and send them out on multiple missions. Just don't balls it up like me. <laughs> well, what, what, how are we supposed to get this back to Philly? Oh, okay. Better not question the Philly magic. I guess we're just going to pull it in our Mary Poppins pocket. Oh, look, some gasoline. I need a lot more uh, supplies now, like gasoline and metal and stuff, because I bought a new building. Okay, right. So there's two different locations that you can get planes from. If I remember correctly, I think I got my first plane from this place, but then because the uh, how the positioning of the um, of Philly's uh, airfield was, uh, it was very it was a pain in the ass to land it. I had to pretty much do a massive flipping 180 in the sky, and it led to me uh, crashing the plane. <laughs> so I think what we're going to do is we are going to go to this one instead, because I think if you take the plane from here. When you fly to uh, the airfield, which I think is over here, uh, you just pretty much go straight into the um, the runway, I think. Yeah, I think the runway might be sort of like here, maybe. Possibly around here somewhere. So if you come from this other one, then it's a bit of a pain in the ass. I think we're going to go to this one. But this one, I think, is a lot more heavily secured. I think we've been to this airfield before, actually. That's why the whole fog of war has been removed. I think, um, yeah, I think this might be when we were destroying planes for that mission involving Carlos, if you remember, when we were taking down the poison and stuff. I think that might have been when we came here. I'm surprised there's any planes left as we technically blew them up, but, you know, they don't like to keep realism in these, uh, in these video games. I think that's one of the things I loved about The Last of Us Part 2. Like, there was millions of things I loved about The Last of Us Part 2. I think the only thing I wasn't really a fan of was the story, but... Um, some of the realistic stuff in that game is ridiculous. Like just some of the teeny little details that Naughty Dog put in that game was just disgustingly good. Like they went above and beyond. Like they really, really made sure that so many little details were in that game. Even stuff that wasn't really that necessarily that important, they made sure to do. Like if you broke like a glass bottle and then came back later, it would still be destroyed and stuff like that. Just little details like that. I love things like that. I want to try and get in here somewhat, somewhat quietly. Because if you get spotted, it doesn't take them very long to destroy your plane. And even if they don't destroy the plane and they shoot it a few times and it starts smoking, special forces, go on you. <laughs> special forces, and it gets fucked up by one bullet to the back of the head. Take that, you son of a bitch. But even if they shoot your plane a few times and start smoking, it makes the controlling of the plane a nightmare. Oh, there's one over here. We can take this one instead. Man, I'm getting very good at these headshots. It does help that they take about four years to notice you. And that's without me even using a good armor set. Oh, I just managed to clip the sort of side of his head then. I think I would have literally given him a haircut with that shot. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, I love this. Like, if you were playing this, because you could play this game in co-op if you didn't know. Um, I have mentioned it a few times, but just in case you didn't know. But you could get player two to sit in there and shoot anybody behind you. Just make sure they don't shoot the tower of your aeroplane. Because then it's going to end up being like a Looney Tunes uh, cartoon. Just remember, L1 and R1 to turn. Don't use the analog stick. Obviously, you can use it a little bit, but not too much. Most of your turning is going to be done with L1 and R1. It took me so much, so much time to work that out. Literally, there's a button right there if you press up that says show controls, and I, I just never did. <laughs> I never paid, a uh, paid attention to the controls. But the planes are just naff and far cry, right? they really are. I definitely prefer the helicopters. I think it's the same in Grand Theft Auto as well. Like, flying a helicopter is relatively easy, but you grab a plane in like San Andreas, oh, it's a fucking nightmare. It was even worse in Far Cry 5 because you had so many of those like water missions where you had to land a water plane. Water plane in like rivers. 
think I'll just like nosedive into the river and sink the bloody thing. I think I did that on YouTube. Far Cry 5 was a very long play, but I remember that going on because I think I did it at the same time as God of War. I can't remember if people enjoyed that play, bro. I think it got enough views. Yeah, see, look, you go straight into the runway like this. Just make sure you hold L2 to slow your plane down. Not too much where you like, just drop out of skyline. God, I hate, I hate planes. Oh, fuck, oh, fuck, oh! What? What are they hunting me for? What did I do? <laughs> what the fuck did I do? I landed on my own. That, that is lucky we didn't blow that plane up. I, I, I pulled back on L2 too soon. What are they coming after me for? What did I do? <laughs> I did nothing. Landed on my own airfield and I get them after me. That makes no sense. Steady. Beautiful. It's beautiful, Hiro. Time to walk the Philly magic. I'll see you back at camp. Beautiful. Am I gonna wait for a phone call now? We've picked up some intelligence on Jose. I think he's starting to crack. So things are going to get crazier. Just what I need. Just keep up the pressure. I'm heading back to the Monteros farm now. See what I can do. There's always something to do on a farm, Danny. <laughs> nice try, Clara. But you're a city kid, like me. Danny, we need you back at camp. What's going on? We need to figure out next steps. I'm on it. See you soon, Espada. Thinking about it, I haven't done that mission yet with uh, Clara. Yeah, we've still got that mission to do in Esperanza. Man, I don't know what to do. Both of these missions are going to take quite a while. What one, what one could I get done quicker? I think we might do the mission with, um, with uh, Camilla. Because I'm pretty sure we might be taking down Jose. Yeah, you, me and the rest of the guerrillas are going to attack the airbase and take out Jose Castillo once and for all. The West will be ours again. Yeah, I think we're going to do this. I think, I think we've got enough time to do this. The mission with Clara, we'll probably do that in the next video. And then after that video, we will proceed to head down to this area and meet up with the Legends of 67. Lovely. Okay, right, let's do this then. Oh, it's, it's going to let me fast travel as well. It's a miracle. And also, Philly's airfield was in a completely different location than I thought. <laughs> I thought Philly's air, uh, airfield was... Um... Hey, look, it's Danny. Yeah, Danny. Oh, I'm still wearing the stupid hat. <laughs> oh, my God, I look like Croc. Uh, this is actually a very good hat, actually. Look, look, look what it does. Improves soft target, blast, and armor-piercing defense. So, literally, all of my defenses go up to all types of damage. All three types of damage. Well, except... Fire and poison. It's beautiful, ain't it? I need to have a look at some of my gear. What do these do? When on fire, flames are automatically put out. That doesn't always work. This could be good, I guess. Greatly improve our defence while sprinting. Good if you're trying to run away because you're nearly dead. I'm going to keep that on for now. I haven't really got many good armor pieces. Yeah, see, I'm, I'm lacking. I haven't looted enough chests. You get a lot of the good stuff from the gorilla chests, and I just don't seem to be finding them. Oh, well, we're going to stay looking like this at the moment. I look like an absolute twat, though. Is this what I'm going to look like in the cutscenes? Because I, I don't, I don't want to look like this in the cutscenes. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be hilarious. What's that? That's like Aiden Pierce. Improve maximum stamina. That could be good, actually, for running around. Oh, yeah, we look like a badass now. We're going to use that for now. I might do a bit of faffing around off camera and try and get a, new, uh, a few new buildings equipped once we've unlocked the uh, new area where the Legends of 67 are. All right, let's have a chat with Camilla. And let's finally take down Jose. So what's our next move, Espada? You got any ideas? You're not listening. You're not listening. Shut your mouth! We have to hit Jose's tobacco. Had enough out of you, Singao. 
You're just gonna let this happen? <laughs> Long time coming, Danny. <clears throat> Montero Justicia. Stop! Your brother's a traitor. See, si. And he'll spend the rest of his life making up for it. You ready to look in the mirror and admit your mistakes? You first, Camila. Fine. I voted for Castillo. I didn't want to, but Vivido was going to make us rich, wasn't it? Mierda, I doubted you. All of you. I blamed you for not being guerrillas. But Papa was right. To get faith, you gotta give it. If you want to... If you want to say, you have to think big. Hidden where it hurts. His tobacco fields. We dried out already. No, all of his fields at once. Draw his soldiers out, leave him open. That's smart. Well, lucky for us, Philip plans ahead. Me and the hero got you covered. Good. We divide our forces. Targeted strikes, checkpoints, guard posts, everything. In and out. And then we hit that airbase hard. Now what the fuck are we still doing here? Dale! Yaranos hasta el final, Roberto. Hasta el final. Nepal Nino. Metal bird, hellfire, and the hope of the West only one. So you've flown this? No, never. I'm afraid of heights. But I'll be the wind beneath your belly. Moral support while you rip Jose a new one. <laughs> Oh, 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 Hiro, Hiro. You're gonna need my soundtrack. Really magic, baby. Now, I'm telling you right now, Philly, we are not gonna be hearing your soundtrack because I've got the music turned off because of copyright. So apologies about that, Philly. <laughs> oh, man. They're gonna make a reaction to the music and we're not even gonna be able to hear it. It's like everybody's gone crazy in this game. All right, so we're gonna be burning a bunch of... Um, Jose Castillo's air f um, tobacco fields and then when we've lured all of his troops out we're going to take down Jose. Lovely. This is a good mission to get the 50 meter up in the sky kill uh, trophy. So if you're trying to get it, do it during this mission. Just shoot an enemy from the sky with your bomb and it will count. Okay, Philly. Let's see what you got. Philly magic, baby. Fucking Philly. Yeah, we, we can't hear the song. <laughs> we can't hear the fucking song. I can't even remember what song it is. I know it is a popular song because I've heard it before. Guerrillas, you ready? I want to hear you. Sanchez, ready. Torres, I'm here. Napalm Nino, all good up here. Serrano, ready. Yeah, there's going to be a lot of chit chat on the radio, so I'm not really going to enhance the audio during this bit because there's just so much chit chat from everybody. This is a plane's feeling a little bit rickety, to be honest. It's not, it's not feeling very smooth. I'm feeling, I'm feeling a lot of vibrations from my controller. <laughs> Make sure when you get near the field, though, you hold, hold back on the uh, L2. Just so you can slow the plane down, because you've got to take. It takes a bit of, a bit of time for your bomb to recharge, and if you're driving too quick, you're going to have to spin around. So just use L2 to slow yourself down a bit. You're a fucking genius. How comes that one didn't can? Oh, it did. Just very slowly. I mean, you might even kill somebody by accident. Oops. How you like that, El Pequeño? Still got more to burn. Oh, it did work. Oh, it did work. For some reason, it just took a long time to register. Or did we miss one? Oh, no, we didn't miss any. All right, it just takes a while to register. Make sure you're aware of that. You don't want to start turning for no reason. Because turning a plane in this game is a fucking nightmare. <laughs> this is basically the Dark Souls, this bit. Is that an enemy plane? No. But yeah, turning a plane in this game, that's the Dark Souls of this game, that's for sure. Here we 
Don't fly. What are you changing the camera for? What do you keep changing the camera angle for? Almost done now. Oh no. I did have I definitely hit that, so it better register. Oh hell yes. There we go. That takes care of the Viviro. And you're next, Jose. Gotta get to that airfield. Alright, I think there's gonna be a lot of chit chat on the radio now. Yeah. Right, we need to go to the airfield now where Jose's been cornered. Okay. Finally get to take this bastard down. Some from Emietas on the left. Watch your fire. Hold your position. Don't move until I say. But when you get near to this place, this is where you can get the trophy. Actually, I don't have the trophy on this account, so I can show you. Watch me completely balls it up now. <laughs> Because there's going to be a lot of people standing on a roof that you can shoot at. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. I didn't know there was an air thing over here. Oh, shit. Well, this ain't going to work. I won't be able to show you then. I'll go for the bailout. Yep. God damn it. Well, if you've took down the anti-aircraft gun in this area... Then uh, just fly over this base, and then there's going to be a roof where the only the last few men are, and just shoot some just shoot some napalm there, and you'll get the trophy. Espada, you okay? See, si. now get your ass over here. On my way. I'm coming. I have my plane shot out of the fucking sky. Good job we didn't need the plane, as I'd be screwed. But we're flying in like Batman, as always, keeping our character going. <laughs> oh shit! I'm not going to clear the fence. Oh. Fuck me out, I landed on the wrong way like a plane. <laughs> Almost there. Where's our tiny head at? One of our guerrillas said he spotted him in the control tower. Okay. Head in there now. Okay. Make sure before you do this mission, I mean, I'm saying it a bit late now, make sure you bring either your Supremo that has the rockets or you bring some sort of rocket launcher. Because if you don't, well, then you're going to have a, a more rough time with this mission. So make sure you bring one. Who's looking at me? Who spotted me? Oh. oh, they're all up there. Okay. <laughs> oh, look at that. Shot him in the shoulder. He stood up and he took one to the face. Poor bastard. Sorry if you can hear the leaf blower in the background. They only like to blow the leaves in the skull whenever I'm recording. <laughs> Every time. Oh shit! <laughs> what an idiot! Oh god, fucking hell. Oh, who, who blew up the anti-aircraft gun? Oh, someone just blew up an anti-aircraft gun for me. Oh, oh well, thanks. <laughs> I don't know what happened there. Man, that leaf blow is annoying. Shit. Shit! I don't know if... Oh, quick, Chorizo, quick! Chorizo, come on, don't just step... What are you doing? Is your wheels broke? What's he doing? What are you doing, Teresa? Why do you hate me? Oh, thank you, friend. Fuck you. Stupid dog. It's because I've got distracted because of the sheer amount of noise at the moment. I don't, I, think you, I don't know if you guys and girls can hear it because it's behind the camera. So thankfully you won't be able to hear it. But I sure can just distracting me. Okay. Oh, 
Hej. Where's the other bad guys then? They must be on the grand level. Oh, well, they can deal with it. Oh great, right, let's get out of this building, that's for sure. Did he blow me a kiss? Oh shit. Right. I've got the tracking thing on this, so it should be a lot easier. Oh no, I shot the stairs! <laughs> oh come on! Right, let's get somewhere with more space. Uh. I want to be somewhere where he has to get closer to me. Ah, uh, where is he? I don't even know if that did any damage to him. I don't know if we're close enough or not. Oh, there's a percentage bar up there. Oh, do we nearly kill him then? Is he only on 17% health? There's someone up here. Oh, there they are. Oh, watch out. There we go. Let's have a test. Oh, yeah, flipping out. We did nearly all of his uh, health and damage just from that one shot. We could probably finish him off with a Supremo, then. Easy. Easy bloody peasy. <laughs> Lovely. One million if you kill her. <coughs> Two million. Got on cigarettes. You could have find this out here. And Don loves me. He'll send this army to rape and murder every one of you fucking Monteros for this. I don't see no Anton. Or your true yard and friends. You know, my papa gave me this blade when I was seven. Told me how to throw it. How to kill with it. <clears throat> you look just like him. Tell me. Is there enough of him left to bury? <clears throat> But this blade doesn't really say Yara's might, does it? You took my land. You took my papa. And now it's time to give. Napoleon el pequeño. No, like I remember it. <laughs> Good boy, Chorizo. Alice gone. Again. That's his choice. And Papa? Did he get a choice? Did he get to see us win something? You never would have won anything if you were still here. 
How the fuck would the Queen of Libertad know? I know he was never going to give you the farm, Camila. Or the camp. But look what you achieved. His father, you are what the camp needed. You are what Libertad needs. You are the one to help us take down Castillo. She's not wrong, Espada. There's no future for the West without help. And there's no future for Libertad without the West. Otteros don't shake. We drink. To the Montero. To the future. You want to confess? Confess. Why are we here? You never even liked Jose. Why? He was an asshole. Why? He was weak. Me papa had a saying. God gives victory to the lions. Sounds religious. <laughs> Me papa love Jesus. He would always say, Jesus would make an amazing Jan and Presidente. Me and Tom always remember Jesus was both the lion and the lamb. Rule with strength, but understand suffering. You believe that? After he was murdered, your grandmother and I were left to survive alone. She would always remind me of my father's obsession with that verse. She hated it. Why? Because he had it all wrong. Be the lion and the lamb? No. She would say, Anton, there are lions and there are lambs. Rule or be ruled. A Castillo must be a lion. For Yara is full of lambs. You don't talk about her. She was always strong, smart, powerful, but <laughs> a woman in Yara. And in those days, she had the wrong skin to lead. Me, Papa, was a lamb. Jose is a lamb. Hmm. You want to know why we're here? You are a lion. And we eat the fucking lambs. you its freedom but we need to build momentum or the revolution will fail maximus matanzas and the legends are out there and they need your help i hear you thanks clara okay i'm gonna have to end the video now wolf wolf it so yeah thanks for watching wolf wolf it hopefully you enjoyed this video next time we will head to esperanza and we will do that mission where we are going to attempt to assassinate anton castillo like share and join the pack today